This video will go over a really cool uh, new feature we added where you now have the option to add links to your images from within the Nifty Images platform. Um, previously, we've only hosted the image URL, um, but now you can add links to each image um, and we will give you the HTML for your image and link um, that can easily be pasted into the HTML of your email within any service provider. To show you, I'll go to a personalized image that I have and you can now see a link icon next to the HTML copy icon. Simply click on this and type in the landing page that you wish to send people to. We also have the option, um, as you see below here, to pass personalization variables, which will automatically pass through the variables that you use in your image. This means you can also have images on your landing page that are now personalized with these same variables. Um, this allows you to continue the personalized experience for your subscribers, past the inbox, and onto your landing page. Passing variables through will work for all images, including dynamic dates for timers, Photoshop images, um, and images using data sources, which pull in subscriber info from an API. Once you click the Save button, you will see that we now include the link in the HTML. Once again, you can just hit the Copy button and paste this into the HTML of your email, and you're done. To show you an example um, of another image, I'll go to a countdown timer. Once again, you'll see the link option. So I'll click this and I can go and type in um, a destination URL. Now, what's great about these is you also can have an expiration URL. So I can automatically change where people will go once the timer is done counting down. Now this will work for any countdown timer, including dynamic countdown timers that you make. Just click the save button and once the countdown timer is done, it'll send people from the sale page to just your normal website. Another place where adding links can really make a difference is our rule sets. Um, being able to display you know, different images based off dates, time, device, location, um, even some advanced things like pulling in uh, query parameters or data sources has been a big addition um, to our platform in recent months. Um, but now you can change the landing page along with the image. So in this first example, I can show you one where we are targeting different devices that are opening this. So people opening on iOS will not only see the Apple App Store button, but they'll go to the App Store page. Same with Android, where they'll see a different button and go to a different image URL. And this is all auto-detected by our rule sets. You can, of course, have a default value um, as well for people that aren't um, clearly on Android or iOS. Another example um, we have here is using query parameters. So this, these are essentially um, variables that you're passing through your ESP. In this instance, we're calling it member status. If it equals silver, they'll see the silver um, elite rewards card, as well as we can send them to the silver rewards page. You can see down here, we also have a gold option and a platinum option. As always, we have a default value. We can send people just to a regular website. Now, once you save this rule set, um, we're going to require the member status merge tag, but that's it. There's no extra HTML. It's one um, image link and the image that we're hosting. Hit the copy button and put this into your template, and that's all you need to do. Now, if you're using um, data sources to um, show real-time content for your subscribers, um, you can also link directly from data sources. So if you're showing a recommended product for each subscriber, um, or an abandoned shopping cart that pulls in the product image, the name, the price, you can also pull in the link. So when they click on um, that image, it'll take them directly to that product or their shopping cart. A few things to note, if you create a rule set that is um, targeting um, off of the email client, we will include an NUID variable in the link. Um, this is a Nifty Images unique ID which can be any variable that your email service provider has as long as it's unique for each subscriber. An easy option is just to use the subscriber's email address here. Also, um, adding links uh, through Nifty Images will not affect any tracking or Google Analytics code that your email service provider may add. Um, now this feature is available now for all Enterprise and Enterprise Plus clients. Um, we hope that you enjoy using this new feature um, and think that it can dramatically simplify your life as a marketer. So uh, we encourage your feedback and hope to hear from you. Thank you.